Good morning. Good morning. We are here today to celebrate schools and more importantly public schools. We're here to show our support to the students and those who come every day and walk in to the schools every day to serve those students. And it is unfortunate that we have not shown the respect to those educators, specifically in the last five years. And increasingly each year, the level of disrespect increases. If you look at a teacher who's been teaching for five years, for five years they've been teaching, they now, at this time, make 13% less than they would have had they been teaching five years in 2008. That's a 13% decrease, despite a raise in taxes, despite paying more for health insurance. That is sad. Mm -hmm. These are the teachers who come to work every day, whose children, their own children, come to school every day. We have a teacher here in the building whose own son took his money and as a surprise gift to her, put it on, it, on her desk in the shape of a heart and left a message saying, I know you could use this more than I could. <laughs> that shows you a couple things. That shows you that student has learned a great deal in school. It also shows you he understands the level of respect that all educators should receive. And most importantly, we are here for the students. People talked about how this originally was going to be a walkout day. I've yet to meet a teacher who actually said they were going to walk out. I think that got blown out of proportion because I know these educators too well and know that they are here for the kids. These are the kids who are being funded 48th in the nation. And you've heard that stat. That's $2,600 less than the national average per student. If you were to take the 396 students who attend EKPO, that equals over $1 million additional dollars. We can do a lot with $1 million additional dollars. I can tell you right now, we, we wouldn't have to piece together three laminators to make one. <laughs> And again, I can't say it as eloquently as everyone here, but we all know, we all know that these people walk in every day, and they walk in for the students who are here. We know across North Carolina they walk in every day for the students of North Carolina. And all we ask is, let's at least show the students of North Carolina that we think they are not just average, but above average, and definitely not 48. Thank you very much. I believe we're going to have one more speaker, and then we are going to walk in and go to work.